Well, all you gotta remember is, so that my wind is blowing this way, so the fire is having to burn against the wind. It's gonna burn very slowly. So I'm starting on the downwind side and I'm just gonna let it burn slowly against the wind. Probably as long as this is staying under control, we'll go ahead, once this is all nice and burned, we'll go to uh, the upwind side and start, start it up over there and let the fire kind of meet in the middle. Rocket, come on down, buddy. The dog, he likes to ride on the four-wheeler sometimes. Rocket, come on down. You you got your ride. Was that fun? Was that a fun ride? Yes, it was, wasn't it? Hey, Hannah. Every once in a while, go fast for just a couple seconds and the disc will kind of dance back and forth and clean the mud off itself. Tell you what, that little disc does all right. We've got the downwind side pretty much going here. You see the smoke, the wind's blowing this way and this way. So we're gonna stay here just long enough to make sure this kind of builds into a wall and it's and it can't go backwards. Once we're confident of that, we're gonna go to the other side of the field and we're gonna light it up. And I don't have any kind of really good tools with me. I've literally have a grill lighter, a snow shovel. And we do have the mower and the four-wheeler with the tiller, so I, I feel pretty good about it, but I see it starting to jump across the fire lane, so I gotta go take care of that real quick. Maybe it's just my imagination. You can stay there, Hannah. So I just kind of lit it up in spots. Oh yeah, that was my imagination. It's My line isn't straight, but it's going fine, so. I'm gonna go check. So this is going great here. This is exactly what you want. It forms a little line and it's gonna slowly burn that way. And I feel pretty good about this back line here. We're gonna have to, we're gonna have to watch it though, definitely. I can't wait, man, this is gonna be awesome. Here's what, here's what the setup's gonna be like. I'm mowing, I'm leaving up a little clump of grass here. This is where the, the deer kind of naturally come this way anyway. So this bean field's gonna funnel them. And we're gonna be, we're gonna be tucked in the weeds. Probably have a blind like right here. And you see. So we're gonna have a blind like right here. And I'm mowing basically a 15 foot circle around here, around it. And we're gonna be able to see all the deer come from back there where that tall grass is and come in. They're gonna come from over there and they're gonna come from there. And we're gonna be hunting this with a west wind which is gonna blow right across the river and they'll never know we're here. Beautiful. Hopefully get my wife to kill a deer here this year. Okay, so we're just going along every <laughs> 10 foot or something and hitting a spot and it's gonna end up lighting up real nice. Lighter, I don't know, if, yeah, it's probably about an acre. Okay, way down there is the four wheeler. We're on the opposite side of the field now, the opposite corner anyway, what we're burning. And so you can see that that fire path over there is just slowly burning against the wind. And now check out over here. This side over here has a little bit of wind with it and so it's kicking and it's gonna come across that field fast. 
It's hot. It's real hot. Never jumped across the lane once. It's good. 